Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to some more Fallout New Vegas Ultimate Edition. We left off here. <laughs> we just killed some aliens, guys. It was awesome. So, uh, originally this is a spot you would get the YCS-186, I think. Just as like a unique Gauss rifle. Uh, apparently it's really good because I got a lot of requests for it. But uh, the people that requested it probably should have known I had Wild Wasteland perk. Unless they joined in later. Because, uh, at the beginning, I had Wild Wasteland perk. In many episodes, I said I got Wild Wasteland. Or maybe they just didn't know, but you cannot get that gun, apparently, if you have the Wild Wasteland perk. Just because you get aliens instead of mercenaries. Which kind of sucks. Because I wouldn't mind using that gun and seeing what it's all about. Do the Hocus Pocus and, you know, all that shit. Anyways, uh, we're going to travel over here to Durable Dunn's Sacked Cavern. And, uh, I'm trying to think. Should I go to Arrow? Eh, yeah, no, what? Maybe we'll go to the New Vegas Medical Clinic. That might... Oh god, not this again. Oh, never mind. We had issues before when it wouldn't let me fast travel for some reason. <sighs> okay. So I got fresh batteries. I am ready to go. That was <laughs> I was ready to continue recording from uh, last time and my damn batteries were out and I didn't have any in this room that I'm recording in, so I had to go to the other room and grab it and I just didn't want to do it on camera because then you guys would be sitting there for a little bit. So finally got that going, then I come back, and my fucking game is like frozen. No matter what I do, it won't unfreeze. So I had to like restart my shit. And travel back there and kill those aliens again. <laughs> so it's been a little bit of a, a disaster, but uh, we're back. Oh, look at that. In the nighttime sky. That is beautiful. And this is the place inside this house. Adorable duns. This is Isaac's house. I don't know if I want to go in Isaac's house, dude. This guy is not friendly whatsoever. Alright, let's go inside of it. Looks like that's where it wants me to go. I believe this is Isaac, I know. Unless this is something different. We'll figure this out in a second. Oh, it's telling us to leave. They wanted us to leave, then why did they tell us to come in here? I've already been in Isaac's house. Let's take a look at the map. Oh, that was weird. Oh, it's telling me to go over here. What the fuck? Anyone else saw that? It was kind of weird. It, was, it wanted me to go through Isaac's house to get there. I can't be the only one that saw that. Maybe I'm going crazy. Whoever made this bridge did a good job. Saves me from going down those dips. Durable Duns Sack Cavern. Another caravan burned. Caravan. Except someone made camp here. And I never heard about this attack. Let's look around. Something stinks. It's probably you. <laughs> I'm just fucking uh oh. Van Graffs. Nope. Shit I just Oh here it is. I thought I spoiled it for a second, but here it is. Van Graffs. Uh oh. See what I'm seeing? That does it. That's all I need to know. Crimson Caravan and the Van Graffs. They were behind burning these caravans and they've got to answer for them. I'm gonna get some extra ammo, a few bottles of whiskey, and then show them how Cassidy's settle accounts. NCR? Are you out of your fucking mind? That'd take years. And with the war with the Legion, no way they're gonna waste time running up the Crimson Caravan or the Van Graffs. All right. If you poke around the Van Graffs and Alice, fine. But if I see either one go into their camp, I'm gonna start shooting, no matter what you find. Ask them then. Yeah, we're not going to do that, because that will... Yeah, we're not doing that. That's the setter. Uh, we're not going to do that. We cannot complete both quests. So we need to do some poking around and get information. 
But I thought we have already done this, but we can go ahead and do this again. Let's go to the Crimson Caravan Company first. And do this, and then we'll go to the Van Graffs and do it as well. Uh, I think you can take her to the Crimson Caravan Company. If not, we have an... Oh, uh, shoot, because once we go in, we're going to have another autosave. We'll figure this out. You might want to let her go. You definitely don't want to take her into the Van Graffs. I'll tell you that much. But it might be different if we took her into the Crimson Caravan. So here we are. If anything fucks up, I do have a save back where we started this episode at. And I could quickly get to where I was, skip through the talking and everything. Um, we'll see if, if, if it comes to that, but I, I should be able to reload. And if I reload this autosave, I'll just be outside the gate. They don't autosave you at the destination. They autosave you before you travel to the destination in case shit like this happens. So here we are. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of poking around. I thought we've already done this though. I thought we've already found the, the piece of information that we needed to find. I don't know, apparently not. Cass is coming with me though, so either way. That guy was just on top of a table. We're gonna try to stay first. We might as well steal everything else. You find any evidence yet? I'm not gonna wait forever. So there's just one more safe to crack? Hope you can get to it. Say what you will about the two leading ladies. They watch their lockers like crows. Still, you got one, so the other might not be impossible. If you get both, then let's talk. And I appreciate you putting yourself at risk like this. Thanks. All right then. Sorry, I was reading a text. So anyways, we got one. We need to go to the Van Graffs and get the other one. This is the one where I think you're going to want her to wait. Okay, I'm, I'm going to tell you right now. Do not take her into fucking the, the Silver Rush. Do not take her in there. Things will not go well. Okay? Because you're intertwining two quests here. If you take her in there, they're going to think that you brought Cassidy there. And that is going to set up something different. Um, I don't want to say anything, but do not take her in there. Things will not go good if you're trying to complete the quest that I'm trying to complete. So do not take her in Silver Rush. Plain and simple. We're going to try to take her in free side. Hopefully she's safe there. We'll figure this out. I'm just, I, don't, I don't mean to spoil it, but I, I'm going to right now because you, if, if you guys will... If you're, if you're doing this anyways, you'll know. But if you took cast into the silver rush I didn't want to spoil this but they will execute her okay there's like a whole thing they talk and then they I think they just execute her so do not take her there okay and this is why you cannot complete both quests because one quest is to execute her and another quest is to not hey, you can't do both you'll see why I'm around minute. helping people around here right the king says to keep up the good work he said to give you this as far as I remember, that's how it worked. I mean, maybe maybe it's a little different. Maybe you have a choice at the end to execute her. Maybe execute the Van Graffs. I do not remember exactly, but I do know that she does have a high... I'm, I'm pretty 95% sure if you brought her into Silver Rush, she would die. Okay? So do not bring her in there. They do not like her. They want to kill her. Okay? Okay. No, they want to kill her because uh, they need to tie up some loose ends or something. I don't really know the whole story. So we're going to go find the evidence in here. We've already cracked a safe at the Silver Rush, but we'll see. Um, Cassidy? Alright, you stay there, okay? I don't want to send you back, but you stay there. We have some auto saves, so hopefully she stays there and she doesn't go with me through the auto save door. Things would not fucking go good. Just in case, let's throw on a save. This is very important because if she does somehow follow me in there because it is through an automatic save area, then, um, well, we cannot have that. I don't think it's going to happen. I think she's going to stay out there, but just in case, might as well save. 
so now it's a silverware rush and I've already cracked the safe in here unless there's another safe I didn't find I just could not grab that for some reason and we'll see what um maybe maybe it was just like you have to have this quest going for that and for piece of information to be there or maybe I just went to the wrong safe I don't think so see the door is open I've been through here before this door is normally locked and then I cracked the safe see the safe is just says open so now it's in here so it's not there before the quest Hello, sirs. Then we're gonna go back to Cassidy. Hopefully, she stays there. She cannot come in this place. I don't know how much more I need to say that. You work your corner, Cassidy. I should have put her next to the other hoe over there. Let's roll out then. You find any evidence yet? I'm not gonna wait forever. No shit. There it is. The blood, the motive, as clear as day. They must have penned these with snake venom. But we got it. Now what? Sure, this damns them, but only if someone listens. Well, Jackson and the Mojave Outpost could get it to the folks in the West. I wouldn't trust anyone closer to the Colorado. And the Crimson Caravan and the Van Graffs have their heart back west. Not sure it'll do any good, though. All right, let's do it. Listen to what he has to say. All right, so let's go back to and talk to Jackson. All the way back at the Mojave Outpost, which we are idolized by, so he should listen to us All right, I gotta reply to this text now because I keep getting them do you work tonight no I don't thank god <laughs> no, actually I enjoy working a lot I actually pick up a lot of hours so but I do not work I don't know why I'm just reading you when I'm texting them <laughs> oh, didn't mean to do that I need a question mark Damn Samsung Galaxy S3. I don't mean to brag. It's pretty fucking awesome, though. Alright. So let's go talk to Jackson. We know Jackson. We've done quests for him, so he should listen to us. And we're idolized by these people. They should listen to us. And we're idolized by the fucking NCR as a whole. So they should listen to us. If I have something to say, you better damn sure listen. Do you know? Hello. Sorry about my little venting issue right there. Jackson, what up, dude? Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you, but nothing else on the radar at the moment. Does he have heart shaped glasses? If we took his hat off, I think those are heart shaped glasses. What is it? Let me see. Alright, this is. This explains a lot of the lost caravans. I thought it was Legion work, but. I can. If you make me a promise, I need you to swear you won't take revenge on Gloria or Alice. If you do, then your case is over, and we can't see that justice is done. I know some things are hard to let go, but you and Miss Cassidy need to understand that. Hear me? I can promise that. What happens after? <sighs> Not even God himself could move the Congress in or out of session. And this... this is a tricky matter. God, what a mess. People turning against each other when the Mojave's at risk of falling? If the Republic's sinkhole progress doesn't kill us, greed will. Thanks for bringing me this. I know revenge must have been tempting. For what it's worth, I appreciate you didn't shed any more blood. We need to save our strength for the Legion. I'll do what I can, and those folks that got killed need to be answered for. All right, so that's that. Well, that's settled, I suppose. No, no, I know. Just hard to say how I feel right now. Wait, that's not true. 
I think the NCR back west, when riled, is going to be the worst enemy the Van Graffs and the Crimson Caravan ever had. They're all so mired in procedure and paper.